So following on from my previous video where I was talking about dreams and the very interesting dream that I had where the big takeaway, the big lesson was surrendering. I wanted to do a video on surrendering, um, releasing control and going with the flow and the spiritual journey essentially. So when we talk about surrendering, we're not talking about giving up in any way. It's actually a case of surrendering what you think you want or how you think things are supposed to go. So basically it's allowing the space for things to come to you in a way that you might not be aware of. Our awareness is obviously extremely limited in the grand scheme of things and allowing yourself to just completely surrender and release control and just allow things to happen as as and how they're supposed to is such such a huge lesson on the spiritual journey. If you've not already figured that out, then you will soon. Um, you will be pushed into situations where you're forced to surrender, um, where there will be so many different things outside of your control that you're not actually able to, to manipulate the way you want them to. You're not able to actually have control. So you just have to get comfortable with surrendering. And it's something that I think we all find quite uncomfortable because we all like to feel in control. We all like to be able to have some kind of certainty and to be able to direct things in the way we want them to go. But that's not always for our highest good. And sometimes what we think we want or the way we're trying to push things isn't actually the way they're supposed to go. By keeping an open mind, an open heart, and by just allowing certain things to be a certain way, that's really when everything sort of starts to align and fall into place because you're allowing the space for things to work out. So the state of surrender is really more of a state of being fine either way. So whether something you want to happen happens or whether it doesn't, knowing that either way you'll be okay and either way it will be for your highest good. So if that thing that you really want to happen doesn't happen, then to just surrender and to release control and not try and force and push things, realise that maybe that isn't supposed to be. Maybe there's something better coming. Maybe it just isn't in alignment right now. And that doesn't mean that it won't be, perhaps further down the line, that thing might come back into alignment. But by surrendering and releasing control, you're really able to open yourself up to things that are meant for you. So this is it's a practice, for sure, getting into that state. And it's also very much a mental thing of not trying to control, not trying to grasp onto the way we think things should be. So, yeah, surrendering has been a big lesson for me. And it's definitely one I'm still learning. But if you would like to know more about this or if you would like to chat about your experience, then feel free to book in for a free discovery call. I'll pop it in the link of this video. Um, and we can have a chat. You can maybe explain um, what it is you've been going through, what you've been dealing with and how you've managed to surrender or how you've struggled to surrender, perhaps. There's no obligation with this call, so it can just be to have a bit of a chat. And if you decide that having a session together would be helpful after that, then we can go from there. But I hope that you are able to let go and allow things to come to you. And best of luck on your journey.